I'm in my new car. How stunning is this? Oh, I just love it. If you're going to a fancy dress party and you want to be a belle, this is the perfect ride. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a brand new weekly vlog or welcome to my channel if you're new here. If you're new here, then don't forget to go down below and subscribe to my channel. I would love you so much. I'd appreciate it so much. Make sure you turn the notification bell so you guys don't miss miss my next vid video. La la la. Um, I started the week on a hike. Um today recently because i messaged a guy so basically update i messaged um i've been looking for a car since my crash um also update on the the whole insurance oh blah, 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 the whole insurance thing i pretty much i'm just waiting for the money now from like the um insurance company and then it's pretty much there i think i've got to ring the dvla or something or something like that but i got i can do that um and then so i found a car um i've been looking for a fiat 500 i really like the idea of a little fiat i don't know why but i do i found the cream one which was selling near me about half an hour away from me um and i was going to go and view it but basically i'd arranged to go and view it on a thursday with someone i know that knows about cars and then the guy messaged me this afternoon saying oh um somebody else is coming to view it tomorrow just thought i'd let you know that and i was like okay no worries um and then i thought i'll have another little look and i found another fiat 500 black fiat 500 2010 um mileage was very low fifty thousand miles um and a decent price um i'm not gonna say how much it was because i mean i don't really need to talk about how much i spent on the car um on here but decent price um low mileage only one owner which is great. Um, and I thought that looks good. And I sent a link to the person that I've been talking to that I know, my friend's brother who knows about cars. I sent him the link and was like, what do you think of this one? And he was like, go for it. That looks great. So I was like, okay. Um, and then again, I, so I've been messaging the guy back and forth about when I could go and view it. And then the guy offered to come, um, to, to me, because obviously I said, I said, I said, I didn't have a car. So I was struggling to get a lift to go and view the car. Um, so yeah, um, he was like, oh, I can come to you if you like. And I was like, amazing. Um, I also messaged my neighbor who is my mechanic, um, and said, are you around at all to help, like just to give, give it a look over. But he said, I'm really busy, but he basically asked for like the number plate and then looked it up and said, you know, it, it looks good. Um, all of the recent checks and, you know, the MOT and everything looks good about it. Um, and I was like, amazing. So, um, yeah, I agreed to go. I've got the car. It's coming. He's coming tomorrow for me to view the car at 11 a.m. I'm probably not going to vlog it because like, I'm not going to vlog some random guy. But I thought I'd let you know. So I'll update you guys tomorrow whether it goes well. But I've got my fingers and my toes crossed. Um, I've got a feeling that this could be the car. It's so nice. I've not even seen it in person, but the pictures look so nice. It's like cream inside. Um, I've just got a good feeling about this. So um, fingers crossed in the next few days we'll have a car. And I'll be able to take myself to work again and get myself made to be. And that makes me happy thinking about that. So I'm on a high at the moment. I'm like, oh, I might have a car tomorrow or I might have a car in the next couple of days. I don't know whether he'll let me like, because obviously he's going to have to drive the car. So he'd obviously need to get home. So I don't know if I'll be able to have it straight away, but hopefully in a couple of days. So, so yeah, I'll let you know tomorrow my update. Hey guys, I'm in my new car. So um, the guy came this morning to um, bring me the car to view it. And I had to, he then took it back to where he lives in Thornbury. Um, and then he, I had to sort out like insurance and things like that. So I've just been with James. Um, he's just gone into Tesco, he's been in Tesco car park. Um, but I thought I would quickly vlog and show you my car. Uh, that's that's not really a good demonstration i'll turn the camera around in a second but oh my god guys it's so pretty like the cream seats um i will show you in a sec and i'll probably give you like a d proper demonstration like either later on or tomorrow um but yeah we literally just drove eva gave me a lift drove picked it up and me and james just came with this in tesco so i want to tax the car um but yeah oh my god it's so pretty I'm in love. I think me and James are going to go for some food tonight, so we're going for a little drive. Um, let me quickly show you. So, first of all, just look at the steering wheel. How stunning is this? 
Oh, I just love it. It's black on the outside. I will properly show you the outside um, another time in the vlog. But it's just so pretty. And you turn the engine on. And it's, it's just so pretty. I love it. So I am obsessed with it. It's just my shit in the back. But, but yeah, I will probably show you it um, another, another, another day. Um, but for now, I'll see you in a bit. Hey guys, happy Wednesday. It is um, 8.30, I've just finished work. I did an eight and a half hour shift, um, so that was fun. Um, I've just got in my car, I'm about to go home. I need to wash my hair because I have work at 8 a.m. tomorrow. And I was like, it quite it was really busy actually, but it quietened down. So I was like, I'm just gonna, just gonna go because I need to wash my hair. Um, I haven't put my car tripod up yet. Um, not tripod, my car mount. I need to like, try and figure out where to put it, but I can't like find a place on my windscreen because like, the shape of the car, like to put it on to get it to fit, but I haven't figured that out yet, but I will at some point get it put on my car. I'm actually just so obsessed with my car still. I just showed someone that I work with. I was like, look at my car. I've been talking about it all day. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go home. What is up with this car? Um, I'm gonna go home and I'll see you guys. I wanna see ya. Hey guys, happy Thursday. Um, I've just got back from work. I just had a little shower um, and changed. I've got my goggles on because me and James are going to the cinema tonight for a little date night, which will be cute. And it's actually worked out perfect weather for like cinema date because um, the weather has been like miserable and raining all afternoon. It is nearly, it's half four, just gone half four. So I'm about to leave. I've just got to take some washing out and hang it out. And then I'm going to go and what, I don't know what we're watching though, because basically we were talking about cinema last night and there wasn't really anything on that I really fancied. Um, and then James literally like messaged me a few hours ago and was like, I've put cinema. So I was like, okay. So anyway, we're gonna, I need to go now because I wanna go get some pick and mix sweets before. And then i um, gonna go to cinema. I'll let you know what we're watching afterwards. I currently, don't, currently do not know. So I'll let you know when I get home tonight, like what I'm watching. I still haven't had a chance to like show you my car on the outside. The weather's just poop and I, I'll show you when it's dry tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I just caught up on Love Island. Stanley is loving life. He's just come and sat in my little cat bed. How cute. It's so cute because I thought that Flo would be the, my, my other cat, Florence, would be more interested in what, like sitting in there. But he's sat in there a couple of times now. He loves it. But anyway, I'm going to go to the cinema and I will see you when I'm back. Hey guys, happy Friday. I've just come home from a 10 hour shift. It is quarter past 10. Um, yeah, I literally did a 10 hour shift. 12 to 10 and yeah it's good to get some hours in. I've done loads of hours so far this week and it's only Friday I've still got two more days um, and I've also next week I'm literally working straight now until like next Friday so I've got a, the weekend off next weekend for the wedding that I've been talking about also I did also order a dress earlier I'll pop a photo in of the dress that I've ordered um I may show you in this vlog if it comes but I don't know if it will come it says it's supposed to come on Sunday so if it comes Sunday I might show you it um but yeah, I've ordered that dress. Um, hopefully that'll fit me. I hope so, because I really like it. I've seen I've had it saved from PLT for a while. I don't know why I didn't try order it before. But yeah, ordered that dress. Um, but yeah, I've had a good day. Um, what was I going to say? Not really a lot else, really. I've got another 10, um, 12, 10 tomorrow. So another 10 hour shift tomorrow. Or it might be less than 10 hours. Depends how busy it is. Oh, depends how busy it is. But for now, I need to have a shower. I need to take off my makeup and get into bed, ready to go again tomorrow. I broke a nail, poor nail, that broke yesterday, but I'm getting them done on Tuesday. But yeah, what I was saying about work, basically, because I've got the wedding, I've, I'm have i basically asked for more shifts in a week. I would usually have a Monday and a Tuesday off, but I said, don't give me Monday and Tuesday off. I'll literally work because I'm having the weekend off. So I wanted to kind of make up the hours because I don't get holiday pay in July or August, which is really annoying, but um, that's what it is. So um, I thought I'll work more and make up then I'll have the weekend off and I won't have like lost out hours. So I'm working Monday 10 till 6.30 and then Tuesday I'm actually only working 10 till 2.30 because I've got a nail appointment and I'm also getting a lash lift next week. So that'll be exciting. Um, and then I'm working Wednesday, Thursday, Friday um, and then the wedding on Saturday. So yeah, anyway, I thought I would just check in with you guys. I feel like this vlog's not really been a lot um, because... Oh, hi Eva. Say hey vlog. Hey vlog. Hey vlog. But yeah, I'm gonna go to bed. Night. 
Good morning guys, happy Saturday. Um, I'm just about to go to work shortly, but I thought I would quickly say hi to you. I edited the vlog this morning for this, this video and it's not even 10 minutes long yet. So I was like, I better make it a bit longer, you know? Um, I've just come and sat on my bed on like a really weird angle of my room, but um, I couldn't be bothered to move the actual ring light um, to the other, to the way that, you know, when you see my background, like anyway. So I thought I'd just quickly chat to you this morning and I've got a little parcel that's come from Beauty Bay. So I ordered myself some more tan because I wanted to, basically I don't get paid until next Friday, but I, so I couldn't afford to order tan, like, like and pay for it. So I went on Beauty Bay and I, they do, they do Klarna, they do the 30 day pay Klarna. And I was like, that's amazing. I can order what I need. And then when I get paid on Friday, I can just pay for it then. Um, so I was like, amazing. So what I've got is the Tanologist Express Tan, but actually this one's um, not the mousse. This is the actual self-tan water. Um, does it come with a spray bottle? It does. Because basically, I've heard people say that people buy this and then they buy a separate spray bottle, um, like from Amazon, and then they spray it. But I was thinking, this already has a spray, so I don't need to do that, do I? Um... It says to spray onto dry skin and blend with a tanning mitt using large circular motions. So I'm going to give it a go. It's the exact same tan as the mousse, but I just thought I would give the water one a go, um, the non-mousse one. And then I ordered myself some more tanning drops because I completely ran out. I was like, I think I must have like spilled the last bit by accident because I had some left. And then the next day I looked and I was like, it's completely empty. Um, so I ordered some more, but I went for the dark this time because recently I felt like the medium just wasn't dark enough when I was doing it. So we've got the dark tanning drops, so we're going to give them a go soon. Um, love tanologist tanning drops. So yeah, that's literally, if anyone has any, re any recommendations on if you do this and you know, like if you put it in a spray bottle or if you just spray it, let me know. Um, but yeah, I got work again today. I've got a full day shift. Um, I need to get going because I've not had anything yet and it is 25 to 12. I've got work at 12, so I need to go and quickly grab some food and make a coffee and I'll see you. Also, I never, I completely forgot, keep, I keep forgetting to show you my car. I will at some point show you the outside of my car, but I mean, it's not raining at the moment, but my car's parked around the corner of my drive, so it's not the best, like, it's not like you can't see all sides of it. So I will show you at some point. I know I keep saying I'm going to, but I will. But um, yeah, I'll go to work. See you later. Hey guys, um, I'm actually so pissed off right now. Also, this angle that I've got right now isn't really working for, for the vlog. Um, but we're just gonna go with it. So literally I was about to go to work and I had a text from not even from my manager, which is why I'm pissed off, from someone that I work with saying, don't come in till four. I was like, right, okay, amazing. Um, I was pissed off that it was so last minute. It was 20 minutes before. I was literally about to leave. I was like to putting a bagel in the toaster and then leaving. I was so pissed off. So change of plans. I've changed out of my work clothes and I'm going to go for brunch with James. I said, are you, are you free? Because I was like, I just want to do something now. I don't want to sit in my ground all day. Um, so I've got till four four now i got work at four now this this car is pissing me off but it just pissed me off because literally like i got ready to leave and everything like i done my makeup which is fine because i'm gonna go for brunch now so at least i put together but i'm just pissed off that it was that last minute and i'm just like mm, not really fair like it's not fair to cancel that last minute and then my mum was like moaning at me like oh you're gonna get paid and i was like well no i'm not gonna get paid man that's not how this industry works you don't get paid for not working whether you get cancelled last minute or not it's just the way it is it's shit and i was like yeah it is shit but that's just the way it is you can't turn around and be like why are you gonna pay me for that she was like oh turn around and say you're gonna get paid for that and i was like no it doesn't work like that you can't just ask to get paid for hours you don't work hospitality doesn't work like that um, as much as it would be lovely if it did it doesn't so anyway i'm going for brunch i think we're either going to go to like curio lounge or there's this little cafe that's really cute. We went to before one had a full breakfast and it was all right to be fair. So we might go there, I don't know. So yeah, I will see you. I don't know if I, I will see, I might see you later. I'm hoping, I will, hopefully I'll show you my car later because um, I'll have time to when I get home. I'm boiling right now, I just put some aircon on. But anyway, I'll see right, you so later. I just got home from my brunch. I'm gonna quickly show you the car from the outside. It is raining, so I'm gonna very quickly show you. Um, so yeah. So I'm just going to be careful not to show you my number plate. So this is the car. 
Ta da! And then I'll show you around the front. There's my little car, um, blowing the number plate out again. So let's just have a quick little look from a different angle. So this is the cream from a different angle. Oh, it's just so pretty. And then the cream seats like that. And then it's got quite a little spacious boot to be fair. Let's show you the boot. Um, this is the boot, not a bad size boot. Just got my little random bits and bobs in there. So yeah, that is my car, lock. Right, I'm gonna go inside and I got leftover pizza from James Had Pizza. So he let me have his, oh, oh lovely. It's upside down, but um, yeah, leftover pizza. <laughs> I'm gonna have that for my tea when I go home from work tonight. But now I'm gonna go inside and chill for a bit. Hey guys, happy Sunday. It is Sunday afternoon. I've just got back from work. It is 20 past, nearly 20 past four. I finished an hour early because it just calmed down. There were like loads of people working. I was like, I was supposed to stay till five, but I was just like, you know what? If it's quiet, I'm just gonna go home. It'd been a long day and I was just like, I wanna go home. Um, so yeah, my pretty little thing parcel came this morning while I was at work. So I'm gonna open it with you guys now and I'm gonna try it on as well. Hopefully I'm just praying this fits me because I ordered it in a size 10 because they didn't have it in a size 12. And I thought, well, hopefully a 10 should be okay. So I'm praying it fits me. I'm always really mean to myself. Like I say, I say this before, like I'm really mean to myself sometimes with sizes, like I'll size myself up. So. This is a dress. So it is this yellow. Obviously it needs to be ironed. The only thing that worries me, it kind of reminds me, um, it kind of reminds me of like Belle. The only thing that worries me about this dress fitting me is the zip. Like a lot of things I find that my, like my chest, not my, yeah, like my sides can be quite wide here. Like doing it up around my back is an issue sometimes. It does look a bit like a Belle dress though, not gonna lie. Um, but yeah, that is the dress. I'm gonna give it a try on now. And obviously like, you can tell it needs a really good iron if I was gonna wear this. Um, but I'm gonna try it on and show you. And then I'm just planning to have a big pamper tonight. A shower, wash my hair, bit of a detox. Not, well, not a detox, but just kind of, you know. Anyway, I'm gonna try the dress on and I'll get back to you. Guys, <laughs> this dress is gonna have to be a no. Um, so this is the dress. And it probably looks okay on the camera, but oh, I don't even know if it looks okay on the camera. It's definitely like, like on the picture, it didn't look anywhere near like a bell dress, but this is like, I've only just got, got my mum to like do it up. It's a bit tight. So I've just got it on, but it's too tight around here and around the back. It's definitely too tight. I could have done with a size 12, but they didn't have the 12. I did think that would be the issue but it's just not, it's, it's too much. It definitely looks like something, uh, the perfect dress. If you want a dress that um, is like, you know, if you're going to a fancy dress party and you want to be Belle, this is the perfect dress. But for a wedding, not really. It's a shame because the style of the dress is really nice, but I just think, the, I thought, because on the picture, it definitely didn't look like a Belle dress, but in here it definitely does, which is a shame. So it will be going back. I need to figure out what I'm going to wear to this wedding now. This is my dress, basically, the one that I've got. This. This flowy dress, which needs an iron. Um, so I need to try and decide if I'm going to wear this or if I need to find another last minute dress online. Um, but I'm now going to go and attempt to get this dress off. Um, but I think I might end this weekly vlog here because I am like I said, I'm gonna have a shower and sort myself out. So make sure you give this video a massive thumbs up, subscribe down below if you're not already, and make sure you turn on the notification bell so you don't miss my next video. Well, it'll probably be a vlog to be honest, because um next Monday, sorry, I'm just looking at my face, my makeup. Um it probably will be a vlog because I haven't got any other videos filmed yet, and I doubt I'm going to. I'm working Monday to Friday and then I've got the weekend off um for the wedding so i don't think there's going to be any any other videos um before next week so i will see you guys for a new weekly vlog next week and i'll see you then bye